good news of our Lord Jesus Christ is relevant as ever, so is the mission of the church. Jesus told his disciples, go into the world and make disciples. In Acts chapter 1 verse 8, the scripture makes it so clear that you shall receive power after which the Holy Ghost has come upon you, and you shall be witnesses unto me in Jerusalem, in Judea, in Samaria, and the uttermost part of the world. This, in fact, reminds me of a story about Jesus um, meeting Simon Peter and his brother Andrew at the sea. I remind ourselves of the assignment that was given to the church and to us as individuals. He said, follow me and I will make you fishes of men. Now, it is not fishes or fishes any longer, like we're in the community here where they fish for fish. But the Lord is calling us to make fishes of men. This year, our 2022 Global Missions Conference is that or is captioned, Go Therefore. This caption seeks to remind and empower, empower the church to proclaim the whole gospel to our communities by word and by deeds, and the whole world by giving a lifestyle of evangelism and sending forth great men and women, you know, in obedience to the Great Commission. Now he said unto them, go into the world and preach the gospel to all creation, and whoever believes and is baptized will be saved. But he said what? But whosoever does not will be condemned. So we have an assignment from the Lord to draw people to the saving knowledge of Christ so that they will not be condemned. Now the scripture says in Matthew chapter 5 verse 14 to 16, it says that you are the light of the world. We are the light of the world. Our objective this year in our global mission conference is to inspire and help develop a lifestyle of a missionary living where we are. It is also to send for God called missionaries into our mandate communities from our Jerusalem to the outermost part of the world. Our 2022 Global Missions Conference is a comprehensive gathering of our churches to advance both domestic and global outreach. Remember, God called the early church to be missionary. And so we don't have any excuse as a church, as a people, as individuals to be missionary as well. Now, guess what? We have our own evangelist Tembra, who will be ministering. We also have um, Peter Mensa, myself, I'll be ministering. And then we have Prophet Takrabedi, who is our guest for this year's conference. It's going to happen on the Friday the 28th through to the Saturday to the Sunday the 30th. And on the, on the, on the Saturday, it's going to be amazing. It is, a, it is a time where leaders are going to be empowered. It is a time where leaders are going to be envisioned. And those who want, you know, to grow in their, the leadership mandates that have been given, it is time for you to be there and you'll be blessed. God wish you bless you and see you on the 28th of October to the 30th of October in our Global Mission Conference. God bless you.